Hey guys, welcome to another video of mine. And in this video, um, actually yesterday, I got a new bookshelf that is actually right here. And it took me several hours. If you follow me on Twitter, you would see me struggling trying to assemble that bookshelf. Finally did, and then it took me another hour just to like organize it and see what I want and all that stuff. The whole day was spent just doing that bookshelf. So I thought I would do like a bookshelf tour for you guys. So yes, let's get on to it. So this is the first shelf and I have some of my Starbucks cups that I like to keep. I got this from Wonderland and it has my name on it. Yeah. This is the Divergent DVD that we got from the HTC Frenzy Presents event. And here are some of my favorite titles. Very few. I have To All the Boys I've Loved Before by Jenny Han, Hemlock by Kathleen Peacock, the first and second books in the Morgan, um, Paige Morgan series right over here. Uh, then I have my If I Stay movie cover edition because oh, I love that book as well as my normal edition, The Sea Tranquility, which I have been recommending to every single person, and my trilogy of the Shadow Me series trilogy. Yeah, okay. Second row. In this second row, I have... I'm going to do this as sort of a feature um, section where I will be featuring a book or a series that I recently read but I'm sort of obsessing about. And this will be The Shadows, and which is actually their fame uh, quartet. The first one is Shadows and the second one is Haze. Only three books are out internationally, but the third one is actually not out in the US. It will be in June. But um, pretty, I'm very obsessed with these. I will leave a link to my double review of both of these books down below. Over here is my review pile. Basically books that I've read that are review books that I need to review and actually write a review on the blog for. So I have Adrenaline Crush, A Little Something Different, Black Ice, and Famous in Love. This is the J pillow thing that my sister made for me at one of her art classes back in high school. And here is my current month's TBR. Um, yeah, I, it's pretty much a thriller month for me other than for Slated, which is a dystopian. Moving on to the third shelf. This third shelf actually contains the books that I own but have not read but really, really, really want to read very soon. So I will actually be taking like one or two of these books into my new TBRs from now on. And moving here is my undergrad diploma for... Um, I studied chemical engineering, so yeah, that's the diploma. Down here is my book haul, which I don't want to show you. There are pretty much the books that I uh, want or need to film a book haul for, so I kind of accumulate them over there, right here. I don't want to show them to you, it's a secret. And then I'll film a book haul so that I don't forget because I tend to do that. And here are some of my Korean music. DVDs, I actually bought them in South Korea. I have Dongbang Shinki. Oh, there's Epic High over there. Hello, Rain B. Yes, hello there. There's Rain B. And then there is my all time favorite movie, Pride and Prejudice. Then I have some manga that I borrowed from a friend. I have my engineering cap from U of T when I was thinking of going there. This is for one of the used bookstores in downtown Toronto. And this is my Siege and Storm nail polish. I have wrecked this journal, and this one's kind of cool actually. I'll show it to you. I have, uh, I accumulate things when I travel. Like over here, I have 101 coin, which is pretty much the currency for South Korea. This is when we went to the butterfly farm in Malaysia, which is kind of cool. So I kind of uh, accumulate some things and then I tape them in this scrapbook. The last bookshelf is pretty much my electronics bookshelf. Wait, electronics shelf. I have four hard drives here. They're all black, so it's really hard to see. Right here, there's one, there's two, and there's the big ones. And then I have my Nook, which needs charging, my iPad, and my, um, I'm blacking out, headphones. And there's my camera case. And all of these are my Entertainment Weekly um, magazines, because I'm subscribed to them for two years. Yay me. So this is a total overview of my new bookshelf, or just, you know, case, I guess, because they're not all books. I'm really happy with all, oh, 
let's not show that. I'm really happy with all of them. I needed some books in my room because they're all outside. So now I have many of them in my room. I don't want to touch them in case they fall. So thanks for watching, guys, and happy reading.